I didn't expect when I first came into SeaTac almost 30 years ago that this the benefit that I would get out of being part of the society would be anything more than the latest science. I very quickly turned from that to becoming um, my go-to place for perspective, for brainstorming, for opening, expanding my thought process on how I can use my skill set to bring science in an understandable way to decision makers, but also to the public, to the general public, in their daily lives. How does this matter? Why does it matter to them? Uh, and so it moved from being this just professional um, outlet to more of a personal outlet of colleagues and a network of friends uh, around the world that I can engage to, to think about those issues and how do we do it better, how do we bring our science into the hands of people that are going to use it and bring it to them in a way that they can understand it so it can be used. And I think that's what over almost 30 years of experience doing this has really um, compounded to make it an important place for me to be and a community that's important for me to be a part of. What this conference brings, what it does really well, I find, is it brings together academia, industry, regulators, NGOs, and in some cases, general public, under one roof, all talking about the same goal, uh, environmental protection. When we come here to CETAC, it's important for us bringing together these people and discuss with them uh, the results from our findings, the findings and our results in order to then apply into the real world. And when I joined, I joined because of the science. I finally found a society that where 2,600 people at one time did what I did, and that was a lot of fun. I rather walk around, see people I know, talk to each other, and this is a really nice thing because if you keep coming, then the family of people you know is increasing. It's not only the typical uh, talk and that's it, so you've got this uh, social stuff, like lots of social events, the science lab, that uh, give a, still, like, still professional but not so serious or not so stiff. I believe CTAC globally can enhance its contribution to society by building bridges with the public and policy makers so, as, so that environmental scientific knowledge can be applied as constructively as possible. Well, it's really great uh, atmosphere here and everyone's really nice to you and they're really, uh, really willing to help you even when it's outside of your field. They're really relaxed and even the big bosses are really easy to talk to. And, and then if you're not sure about what you're going to do after graduate, then I think you're the right place to come. Here you can meet, um, you can meet up with the company working in environmental sciences and also with the people from the research center or the student in the same field. You can get many ideas about yeah, what will be happen after graduation. Then. And of course, a uh, cool opportunity to talk with experts in their fields or in your field about your research you're currently conducting. I think that when you have the opportunity of putting together 2,000 environmental scientists from different fields, the, the leap forward in the science is so important. 